Hello people of the internet, and today I'm going to show you how to download mods on Super Smash Bros. 2. So to do so, you're going to need a copy of the game, but I bet you already do. And you're going to need to download the DAT files on YouTube. So for example, I'm going to show you one. So I searched up Ultra Instinct Goku mod on Super Smash Bros. 2. And you're going to go to the link below, and you're going to click on the link that they give that they give you and the DAT file if you're confused on what it is it is basically the character file for the characters in the game so once you replace it it replaces the actual character and then your mod is going to be in the game for you to use so once you download, there's going to be a green download button. I'm going to refresh the page to see if it'll show. See there, it's a big download button. You can't miss it. And once you download it, you will have it as a DAT file like I have right here. So from there, what you have to do is you have to go into your game. Let me pull out the game real quick. And you will drag it to your data file. You won't, like, in the actual game, let me see, you will have only the data file and the daddy.exe file. If you drag it into here, and it'll ask you if you want to replace it, or to keep both or stop, you have to click replace. But because it's already in there, I don't have to, so I'm going to stop. So once you have everything all set, you just got to open your file here. So I'm going to do that really quick, and I'll see you when it opens. All right? Okay, so we're here, and we're gonna go into solo. Okay. Let's change the game. Go! So as you can see, it works, and I'm not gonna show too much since I will be releasing in another video soon. Which is gonna cover all of the details on all the So I'm gonna go this. And with that said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.